When I was very young and began receiving an allowance and birthday gifts, my parents began to explain tithes and offerings to me. Soon I was making my own personal contributions, and what I remember to this day was receiving my very first year-end giving report. I was probably six or seven years old. My report totaled all of a dollar or two, which would have been easy for our treasurer to combine with my parents' report. But she didn't. She gave me my very own, and it made a deep impression on me. This was my church. I was a part of it. When something good happened, I was a contributor, however small. In every baptism, I could be a stakeholder. It is my privilege to work in this conference in two areas with stakeholders, large and small. The first is with trust services. When most people think of trust services, they think of estate planning with wills and trusts. And we do a lot helping members who care deeply about creating solid plans to care for their families and who also have a passion for kingdom growth. And I receive great pleasure from sitting down with them and creating a plan that fits their specific needs while also helping them formalize what God has uniquely put on their hearts to benefit His work. But it's not just about the future. I also work with individuals who want the privilege of making a difference now. Maybe it's a vacation home they no longer use, appreciated stock, or a good but no longer needed vehicle. And I have the opportunity to connect a donor with a need and watch their joy in seeing the transformation through their gift. Secondly, I work with stewardship, reminding each of us of the privilege of living a life of partnership with God through the careful use of our time, abilities, and resources. This is another thrilling part of my job as I get to preach the joys of partnership, provide practical seminars, and share resources with members across Upper Columbia. I love being a stakeholder, first as a member, second in the office, of what this conference is doing to win people for Jesus. And I love helping others as they dream of how they can be part of winning one more for the kingdom.